Hey guys, Erica Arnaya here. Welcome to possibly the fanciest setup I have ever done a video in. We're back in my living room because my room's a mess. We've got this nice painting of some flowers. We've got a real candle and a fake candle. I'm sick, that's why I sound weird. My throat hurts, my nose is stuffy. Thanks diet shampoo. I was at Lauren's house this weekend and she was sick, so we all know who I got it from. So I'm here today with some very exciting news, as you probably saw by the title. I'm going to NYCC this year! For those of you that don't know, NYCC is New York Comic Con, and I've wanted to go for the longest time. Previous years, it was like, I'm not sure if I can go, I don't want to buy a badge and not be able to go, but this year, I'm going, baby. I'm going. Friday and Saturday only, because Lauren goes with her parents on Sunday, and they do this little Willy Wonka cosplay. I will insert a picture of it here. Yep, it's hilarious. I love it so much. I'm here today to share with you what Lauren and I will be cosplaying at New York Comic Con this year. I am going to be sharing my cosplay plans with you, all the while revealing some awesome merch that FanPit was generous enough to send me. FanPit is an awesome website where they have like tons of anime and Marvel and Game of Thrones, just like fandom merchandise, all sorts of clothing. They have like decorative stuff. I got a blanket. They sent me a bunch of cool stuff. I'm gonna show it to you. I'm gonna tell you what I'm cosplaying to New York Comic Con. And then I'm gonna link you to all this stuff down below if you wanna wear it to New York Comic Con or some other comic anime related event that you go to. So if you're not a cosplayer, or if you are, you can pick up some cool merch to wear to cons or not, or just around the house. Going to the mall with your friends. I don't know, wherever you like to wear your fandom merch, you can you can wear it. I also have a blanket, so I guess you could wear that out in theory, but it probably wouldn't be very practical. I haven't actually taken any of this stuff out of the bags, except for the blanket, because I was really excited about it. So Lauren and I don't actually know which days for sure we're going to be wearing which cosplays. They will be on Friday and Saturday. I'm not sure in what order. I'll let you guys know on my Instagram closer to the date which cosplays we will be wearing on which day. So the first two things that I picked out for Fan Pit to send me are these amazing Thor and Loki hoodies. I will be cosplaying Thor. Thor was my first cosplay ever, so I am really excited to be bringing her back. We're doing lady versions of Thor and Loki, but we're doing like the movie costumes, so just a little bit like Fem femininized. Like I'm gonna wear a skirt instead of pants. I don't know how it's gonna go. I'm excited to have a cape. So I haven't taken this out yet, but here she is. Oh my God, this is ridiculous. I love her. So this is the Thor hoodie. This Thor hoodie is a size small. It's from Fan Pit. It's like one of the movie costume designs. I will link it down below, but it is called the God of Thunder unisex pullover hoodie. On the back, it has a cute little cape moment. Like it's made to look kind of like his costume and it looks like it in like the most amazing, campy, wonderful way. To pair with this fantastic Thor hoodie, I also got Lauren. A Loki hoodie. I love Loki. Loki's my favorite character in the MCU. I kind of wanted to cosplay him, but I had to pay homage to my first cosplay ever and do Thor. But maybe I'll cosplay him in the future, like a girl version. Anyway, the Loki hoodie. Similar to the Thor hoodie, this is the Loki unisex pullover hoodie. It is also based on one of his movie costumes, so on the front and the back it's sort of like a sweatshirt printed replica of them. This is a size small. They run a little bit big, but I like to wear my sweatshirts pretty big. So yes, those are the Thor and Loki unisex pullover hoodies from Fan Pit. I am so excited to cosplay Thor and Loki. I love Marvel. Loki's my favorite character in the MCU, but I stand the Avengers so hard. If you're into Marvel, Comment down below, maybe we can chat and cry about things. One day of Comic-Con, Thor and Loki, baby. Buckle up, get ready. Moving right along, I need to look up the name of the next thing before I start talking about it. It is perhaps my favorite thing. The freaking look at it, it's so amazing. This is a House Targaryen blanket. Season eight really came for my girl, Daenerys Targaryen. She was done dirty, we all know, but does that mean I love her any less? No, girl. Daenerys Targaryen is my queen. <laughs> Nothing but respect for my queen. This is 
an amazing blanket that I now own. It can keep you warm on all those cold, cold nights spent crying over season eight of Game of Thrones. This is the GOT House Targaryen throw blanket. I love her. They have so many different kinds of blankets on the site. One side is the, the design and then the other side is just like, fluffiness. I'm sure you're wondering who I'm gonna cosplay at Comic-Con now. It's Daenerys. I am going to be cosplaying season eight Daenerys Targaryen. Lauren is going to be doing season eight Cersei. We're going to be an awfully powerful duo walking through the halls of New York Comic-Con. We just love Game of Thrones. Yes, we hated the ending, but the costume design is the one thing that never failed us. That is all for the cosplays I will be wearing at Comic-Con. So we've got Thor and Loki with me as Thor and Lauren as Loki. And we've got Daenerys and Cersei with me as Daenerys and Lauren as Cersei. We're doing season eight, baby. Please don't come for us. Still love the characters. The ending was bad. So update, my camera is playing me. I have two more items to show you and I did the whole video of showing you them, only to find out that my camera had stopped recording because I ran out of space on my memory card. So I'm not thrilled about that, but I got a new memory card. I'm like super paranoid now that like, it's just gonna stop recording. The last thing that I picked out from FanPit was this Survey Corps zipped jacket. This jacket is like the exact same color as the cosplay jackets, like the jackets that they actually wear in the anime. This is a great way to show your anime appreciation if you want to go to Comic Con and say I love Attack on Titan. It's a size small. It is really, really nice. It's got all the detailing. You got this Survey Corps logo in the front on the sleeve and of course on the back so you could tell from all angles that you're an Attack on Titan fan. The last thing is something that FanPit sent me as a surprise gift because I did not pick it out but it's super cool and I'm really happy that they sent it to me. It is this really awesome bomber jacket. So this is the Xavier School for Gifted Youngsters bomber jacket. It's like a windbreaker sort of material. I kind of wish that I picked out another one because it's like really nice. It is an X-Men one. So on the back it says Xavier School for Gifted Youngsters. So you can pretend you're a mutant. There you go. I don't know much about X-Men. My knowledge is limited to like two and a half Wolverine movies. I apologize for that. So that is all for the amazing merchandise that FanPit sent me. Thank you so much to FanPit for sponsoring this video and sending me all this amazing merch. I had so much fun reviewing it and telling you what I'm wearing to Comic-Con in the process. I will have a discount code for you guys if you wanna buy any of this stuff from FanPit or any of the other merch on there. They have so much stuff, so much Marvel stuff, so much Game of Thrones stuff, so much anime stuff. I will leave the coupon code in the description. I don't have it as of now, but I probably will have it by the time this video is up. So if you're interested, check that out down below. I will link all this merch down in the description as well as just the link to FanPit's website if you wanna check them out. I am so excited for Comic-Con this year. If I'm gonna see you there, please let me know down in the comments. I'm over the moon, so excited. I've I've wanted to go for so long. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like and a comment. And if you're not subscribed already, subscribe. This has been Eric Carnaya, and I'll catch you later.